application was brought to me several years ago now, a possibility of hiring a handicapped fireman, a handicapped person for a fireman. I said, well, have y'all done your research? Yes. And then I got to meet Curtis Shaver. And I promise you, there was never, ever a doubt of him becoming a firefighter in Troy, Alabama. And I am proud to stand here today, so proud to have him being our representative on the national stage, the representative for the city of Troy, Alabama. We could never, ever ask for anyone to be a better representative than our own Curtis Shaver. At this time, we want to continue the program, and I want to bring Yvonne Breezy up for the presentation. Thank you, Mayor Lunsford. Crown Royal is honored to recognize the unsung heroes of America through our Your Heroes Name program that we run every year. Since the program started in 2007, we have met some incredible people with amazing stories. And we've helped them feel like kings on a race weekend. This year is no different. With Curtis and the other finalists all truly exemplifying the word hero. All of the finalist stories showcased a wide variety of personal achievements, sacrifices, as well as a loyal commitment to giving back to their communities, both here and abroad. We asked Crown Royal fans to go to our Facebook page and cast their votes for the hero they most wanted to see at the race at the historic Indianapolis Motor Speedway this year. We'd like to thank all the fans who voted, and especially all of you in Troy, Alabama, because we know there are a lot of you who voted for him. We're very excited to be here today to make this special announcement. It's, gentlemen, it's time to reveal the banner and put a name on this year's race winner. Crown Royal presents the Curtis Shaver 400 Brickyard, powered by BigMachineRecords.com. I can't tell you how special it is to have everyone join us here today. On behalf of Crown Royal, I'd like to thank Mayor Lunsford, the City of Troy, especially those at the Troy Fire Department, the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, Scott Borchetta, founder and CEO at Big Machine Label, Label Group, and Justin Moore for attending today's announcement. I'm so very proud to be here. This truly is the fa my favorite thing I do all year long. And we're so excited to make this year's race an experience at Curtis, you and your family and your friends, and the city of Troy will never forget. At this time, I'd like to invite up the president of Indianapolis Motor Speedway, Jeff Belskis. Speedway, I want to congratulate Curtis and and uh, we have the leading whiskey brand in, in the world with Crown Royal and the leading racetrack in the world with the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. It's going to make sports history as, as we name it the uh, Curtis Shaver 400 at the Brickyard. So thank you. Uh, um, We look forward to hosting you and and uh, and the other uh, heroes that uh, race weekend. I guess we're eight days away or ten days away from from the race, July 29th. So uh, look forward to having you in Indianapolis, and and we're going to have a great event at, at, a, at a very historic facility. And and again, we're we're appreciative to Crown Royal for for your support, and and uh, this is a great program, and and it's our first year to be involved with it, but we're we're very excited to be here, and also Scott and everyone at Big Machine Records. Uh, uh, we love what you do, and, and uh, thank you. So um, with that, uh, I also appreciate uh, feeling a little bit of home here with uh, a yard of bricks. And, and, of course, the Indianapolis Motor Speedway is often referred to as the Brickyard. And I'm going to ask Curtis to come up and join me in placing a brick here.
know, uh, this is big. Yeah, it's very big. And, uh, uh, of course, I don't, you know, it's, it's just humbling. I, I'll leave it at that. It's very humbling. And I would like to say that the the other finalists, one of the things I would like to say about them is they're definitely not losers by any means whatsoever. Any means whatsoever. They are great American heroes, and uh, I will be honored to shake their hand and tell them thank you for what they did for my family and their communities and my country. And uh, and uh, I want that's definitely uh, something that I'm looking forward to to uh, shaking their hands and telling them thank you for what they did because they are true American heroes, and I appreciate everything they did. And I'd like to thank this community. Um, this community, uh, you know, went out and voted, and, and uh, I appreciate that. I do. And just hope that I can re represent you well. I plan on doing that. The Troy Fire Department and firemen across this country and what we do every day. And uh, thank you for the city of Troy, Mayor Jimmy Lunsford, the council, for giving me a chance, for giving me a chance to... Uh, to prove myself, and I made a vow that I will never let you down, and from this day forward, I never will. I'll continue to always give you 100% of what you deserve out of me and out of our fire department. And I just don't know what else to say. <laughs> Thank y'all. Thank y'all very much. What a beautiful day, and it's great to be here in Troy, Alabama. Uh, we're a Nashville-based label, and. Uh, we have a, a wonderful relationship with Indianapolis Motor Speedway and very proud of our association with Crown Royal this year. And when they told us that we were going to have an opportunity to participate in the Your Hero's Name Here contest and project, we were, we're really honored. And when we talked to all of our artists about being involved, which includes Justin Moore, the band Perry, Mavericks, and, uh, and all the great artists at the Big Machine Label Group that includes Taylor Swift and Tim McGraw, Rascal Flats, Martina McBride. You know, there, there's a great sense of heroes, and there's a great sense of storytelling. And when they told us that it was going to be a, a firefighter from Troy, Alabama, that was going to win, it was just, uh, I literally got goosebumps because uh, I think since 9 11, I think we've all had a heightened awareness about who the true heroes are for the United States of America. And I'm so honored that uh, one of our our most successful artist, when I told him about what we were going to do today, he dropped everything he was doing. He was in Nebraska this morning. He jumped on a plane, and uh, he wasn't going to miss this. So I'm going to ask my good friend and Valerie music recording artist, Justin Moore, to come up, and then uh, if you're okay with it, Curtis, he's going to sing a couple songs. Yeah? <laughs> Please welcome Justin Moore. Uh, well, thank you guys for, for letting me be a, a small part of this, Crown Rule, and everybody at the Indianapolis uh, Motor Speedway. Um, I grew up in a town just like this, and um, so I know I know these types of communities and, and how they operate, and they're the best places in the world to raise kids, and um, I'm raising mine and mine. So um, I just want to say congratulations. Thank you for, for serving our country and what you do, uh, and I know all these people are proud of you and um i appreciate you guys having me and, and congratulations again have a blast at the race so i'm gonna do something i actually know how to do now so. <laughs> okay,